Oh, yes, celebration, guys. It looks like there's finally a fix to these raid bugs that have been occurring ever since this update 5.2 dropped. Also, there's a couple bugs with Silver Surfer. We're going to discuss both of those. What's up with Yelena's animation? And we just got a blog that was dropped on the official Marvel Strike Force website. We're going to talk about all of that, guys. And if you're ready for it, find that like button. And let's go smash it! Alley flying. What is up, Valley Maniacs? I am Valley Flying. Welcome back to the Valley Flying channel. I hope you're having a great day. And I hope you're ready to discuss a lot of bugs. There's a lot of bugs that happen with this update 5.2. And we're going to discuss all of them. Raids, Silver Surfer. What's up with Yelena? And uh, yes, there's, there's some very disappointing rewards or some surprising rewards from this third anniversary calendar that we're going to get into guys now if this is your first time here subscribe to the channel more great marvel strike force content other content coming on this channel as well and hit that notification bell so you get notified as soon as the video is released and uh if you like this video make sure you share this with all of your alliance mates guys but without further ado let's get into these bugs let's first start talking about this one boom that looks like it was just solved this was posted on reddit by zeke's uh, a few hours ago and this and it said this now as you know uh using the difficulty slider for the raids ever since this update 5.2 drop uh does not work it looks like there's a a sim button but uh, there's nothing that you could do there so you just got to force uh, close the game uh not very fun but it looks like it's finally going to be fixed in a couple hours there uh on tuesday there was an issue with launching alliance raids that have a raid difficulty slider and this didn't just apply to one this applied to the uh ultimate seven it also applied to these greek raids that are running right now so both raids affected that anything that has a difficulty slider was affected by this bug applied which uh, resulted in having to turn off the raid difficulty selector feature we are currently rolling an update out in order to resolve the issue and there was an update this morning i was wondering what it was what was fixed it just said some general bugs are fixed not this one though so it looks like uh, we might have to reinstall the game in a little bit once this rollout is complete around 3 p.m pacific which is very very soon we'll be forcing the update to all players once it has been made available to all players we'll be turning back the raid difficulty selector we'll be turning back on the raid difficulty selector and if you're an alliance that uses the raid difficulty selector we advise that you wait until we turn it back on before you launch a raid we'll be discussing compensation after the fix goes live thank you for your patience as we worked on getting this issue resolved so i'm glad they got this issue resolved i wish they would have communicated this a little sooner we got we got note uh early uh, late on tuesday night that this was broken but now we're getting word that they found a fix it's gonna be uh fixed very soon what do you think the compensation should be for this though guys i know some people were really pushing hard for these moon knight milestones they're really pushing hard for these raid season wars now a lot of people got affected uh, unless you're really with the doom raids though uh this i'm not sure if there's really reason to be pushing but what do you think what do you think the compensation should be for this issue now there are a few issues going on with silver surfer as well let's take a look at from another post from zeke's on march 16th and this this was available at launch and it looks like set there, there was a there was an offer for silver surfer you could purchase the offer twice but looks like uh some people were able to get this multiple times and not just two times like uh, we were supposed to so what is being done on march 16th there was an offer that went out with silver surfer shards some players were able to purchase this offer more than in the intended two times uh we were enabling this offer again in the coming weeks for those that were unable to purchase the offer more than twice very very uh interesting dilemma and interesting solution here uh, i know some people I uh, proposed some various different solutions for people that uh, were able to purchase the offer multiple times, not just those uh, two times that we're supposed to. Uh, and I know there, there was kind of a precedent on this when people were uh, manipulating the system to purchase different offers or to purchase offers more than once that uh, they weren't supposed to purchase more than once. Back in 2018, back in year one, I know there was some people that got their accounts banned. This is kind of a weird situation, though, because uh, it's it's kind of a weird precedent if they start banning people for spending money. So uh, I, I'm not sh I don't think they're going to do anything this time. I'm not sure how many people were able to purchase more that Silver Surfer offer multiple times, but uh, this is the solution. So it looks like in the next coming weeks, we'll be able to purchase it if we want to so this does benefit some people but uh let's go take a look at uh what's going on with silver surfer right now because 
this was the first bug the offer uh i'm not sure if this was necessarily a bug or just some weird system or people intentionally manipulating this but this was not intended let's take a look at something that was also unintended and this was from the live stream few days ago let's take a look at this silver surfer animation here guys that's pretty cool and yes we're taking a look at it there did i miss your dd4 how is Wait, i think we're playing up? some real-time arena uh, here and <laughs> and silver surfer's move is going to come up in just a little bit long here it is guys that great but all right we want let's go heal block that'll be a lower resistance for everybody and big a oh, oh the move's goodness, so the powerful time it crashed the game crashed the game Crash the game is such a powerful move, guys. That uh, is how strong Silver Surfer is. Let's talk about this calendar, though, guys. This calendar. This was. This is from the future. This is from our brethren that is in Oceania. They got this calendar a little early. And as we can see here, we got some legacy orb fragments, training fragments. The thing that is not pictured, I believe that is the uh, currency that we're supposed to be getting. It's called the Cosmic Essence. And uh, we also got some silver promotion credits, some alien spores, some uh, some purple ability materials, and it uh, looks like some good stuff. Here's the thing, though. I think we're supposed to be getting a lot more because if we go to the blog post from last week, this was from March 12th. And if we look at this universal truth, oh, actually, that, that one, this is the one. This is the one that we're supposed to be hoarding our stuff, guys, after they said no more hoarding. But let's look at this anniversary calendar. I'll log in for 14 days to earn cosmic essence. That's that's what the thing that is missing in the promotion credits. Gold promotion credits. Not in there. Not in there. Superior basic catalyst parts. They are in there. Legacy orbs. They are in there and more. And if we go back there, we got silver promotion credits. No gold promotion credits. And again, this missing thing, I think, is this cosmic essence. I guess it's not in the game yet. But what is up with that? What is what is gonna happen with this? What do you think is gonna happen? You think they're also gonna give us some gold promotion credits? Just saying here this is for you guys or say oh this was kind of like with the legendary event saying hey that was a mistake we didn't mean gold we meant silver and this is what we're supposed to get or is this a bug or they're going to correct it by the time this rolls around for the u.s guys let me know what you think is going to happen with this calendar is this going to be what was released let's talk about another bug though or i guess it's not a bug it's, it's, it's described in these 5.2 release notes here so we take a look at this from uh march 16th this was earlier this week we go down here to bugs one bug that was corrected i guess it's, it's, it wasn't really a bug but from russian with flair yandelena belova now has a slick entrance animation and we were looking for this on stream this week guys we we're trying to figure this out we tried this at high graphics mode we tried this at 1x speed a bunch of different things and this is the conclusion that we got drawn to this is uh for again another replay from the live stream if you guys want to check out that yelena that slick entrance animation guys this is it we are looking for this right here and there it is what? that was it and I, you might have missed what? it you might have missed it so let's go like back here well. and let me play that again. there it is there what? there was what? a slick new what? entrance animation guys and, let's and that what guys was worthy of this blog post describing that so let me know what you think of that new slick entrance animation I know I was a little disappointed. I was looking forward to the Doctor of Style, the Slickster, Jive Soul Bro, or they're talking about From Russian with Flair. I was wondering, maybe they're talking about Slick Rick, the Nature Boy, but nothing, guys. Super disappointing. That's kind of a review. Let's take a look at this blog post that just came out. And honestly, there's not a lot of new here. We got the Polaris kit, which was revealed in my video earlier this week, the Envoy video talking about Polaris and how good she is. Very like a, like a, uh, I don't know about a better or worse version, a different version of Magneto. And very, very uh, indicative uh, with the title of this blog post, like father, like daughter. And she does some very, very good things uh, as part of this X Factor. Uh, yeah, just, just so much crits. You got this crit on this special right here. We got a big Magneto-like move, but instead of blinding the enemies, you're disrupting the enemies. And then you got so much synergy here with war on war offense and yeah even more crit uh passives guys we got some passives of uh long shot shatter star that offer a lot of benefits to this x factor team with these crits uh well she's also going to do some good stuff with the crits she's going to remove deflect from the most injured non-summon enemy and if all of that wasn't enough when an enemy attacks this character or any ally with barrier which she gives herself barrier shatter star gives the entire team barrier if you're getting crits guys you're going to attack, you're going to apply bleed to that enemy. So it's kind of like a counter attack looking very, very strong. Uh, multiple man looks like he's going to have an event coming up. So uh, use that super slew tag for uh, multiple man. A lot of great characters there. 
and then no release method yet for polaris but let me know what you guys are expecting i think the word the rumors amongst the community is another blitz release character so let me know what you would want to see as her release method and what you're predicting for her release method upcoming blitzes we knew about this from the marvel.com article a few weeks ago crystal is coming up black widow also coming up i think crystal is going to be the monday blitz black widow is next week's thursday's blitz, and we got some bonus and flash events we got that night nurse bonus event uh where you can turn two x character shards for her that was also described in this marvel uh dot com article in celebration of women's history month and also block party coming back t4s guys t4s next week we should get some double drops for some city characters but more t4s guys let me know how you are going to spend these t4s and let me know what your favorite part of the blog post was guys there's a little light on the blog post but uh it looks like we're going to fix the raids they're going to fix the uh silver surfer some oh i don't know if they're going to fix the silver surfer but there are some bugs in silver surfer one of the things the offers i don't know what i don't know what's happening with this ultimate because uh there was a new update this morning it's the ultimate still did not work on blue stack so let me know your thoughts on it and i guess it's i guess uh, i'm hearing reports it's not working on ios either so if it's working for you let me know if it's not working for you let me know in the comments but yeah even as good as silver surfer is uh it, it's not very good if he's breaking the game so hopefully that gets fixed very very soon i will see you guys next time i hope you guys enjoyed this video check out some of my other videos before you go and uh yes let's grow this channel guys i guess there's, there's just some cool things that i want to do when this channel gets to 40,000. so share this with your friends and uh let's grow this channel guys before you go give me a hulk fist bump and i hope you guys enjoy falcon and winter soldier guys give me a hulk fist bump valley flying out have a great weekend guys <laughs>